1973 was a very unique year for Corvette. Not only were we dealing with the fact that we were moving to unleaded gas from 1971 and they changed the way they rated the horsepower, in 73, federal government mandated five mile an hour bumpers for the front. As many of you know, 74 marked the year that they mandated them for the back as well. So that makes 73 a unique year with the chrome in the back. You'll often notice that these older cars like this will have two colors here. Most of the reason being is, is these are a different material than this and getting the paint to adhere the same is a little bit more difficult. This is a 1973. It is an absolutely loaded 1973 matching numbers car. Um, so it's an air car, power steering, power brakes. Um, it's a power window car, tilt and telescoping. So all the bells and whistles, the original smog equipment in the front of the engine. This is a matching numbers, 350 cubic inch engine at 190 horsepower rated. Caps and bands on the car, good. I would call the paint good. Uh, because of our two-tone and such, I would say good, not very good. Chrome on the car is in good shape. And our luggage rack. So Ontario orange with the beige interior or tan interior. Tilt and telescoping wheel, the M20 four speed transmission. The original style radio in the car, the leather on the seats is very good. I would call the carpet good, starting to show just a little bit of fading. And this car has a documented 64,337 miles on it, I believe by title. Definitely a new gear with a different, with a bumper on one end. A really fun car to drive and worth a look. 770-605-2056 or email john at buyavet.net if you'd like to see this or any of the hundreds of Corvettes we carry in stock. As always, subscribe to the YouTube channel so you can see all the new stuff first, and we'll see you all out on the road.